And lastly, I'm going to release a prophecy on Cameroon. That is my country of origin. Now, for Cameroon, I saw an earthquake for the first time. An earthquake for the first time hitting the nation of Cameroon. And it was hitting Cameroon from the southwest region. And the southwest region, the place is specifically called Boya. Boya. In that place, there is, a, there is Mount Cameroon. We have a mountain in Boya, in, in, in southwest region. The highest mountain in Cameroon is in Boya, southwest region. There is an earthquake that will soon, in the future, God did not tell me the date and the time. God did not tell me the date and the time. But the Holy Spirit ministered to my spirit soon. There is a, an earthquake that will soon hit Cameroon. And I prophesy revival in Cameroon. That revival is coming so strong. So strong. I told you guys that that revival is coming in sports, in academics. That revival is coming in, in, in infrastructure, in infrastructure area uh, routes. That revival is coming in in the government. It's coming in every aspect in Cameroon. And I saw Cameroon shooting and blooming. And I saw many people coming from different nations in order to watch what God is doing in Cameroon. I told you guys that that revival is coming and that it has already begun. But then I see God judging this area in Cameroon because... Uh, because because there is a lot of evil in that area and there's a lot of evil that is taking place in that area so God will send will thunder his voice by an earthquake God will thunder his voice by an earthquake to this place in Cameroon called Boya for the first time they will experience earthquake some countries in Africa have experienced earthquake like Kenya South Africa I, I believe so even Zimbabwe I think I don't know but for Cameroon they have never experienced an earthquake before that is why as I post this video on YouTube many of them will attack me many of them will not believe it but it will still come to pass whether they like it or not because I'm not I'm not speaking on my own authority many of them won't believe it imagine you prophesy an earthquake to a nation that has never had an earthquake what do you think they're gonna say they're gonna say you are crazy they're gonna say all things about you but it's okay but guess what prepare for an earthquake that is coming and when you get that sign of the earthquake know that it is that the earthquake will like be so strong for four to five seconds one two three four those four seconds will be strong shaking so strong and then from the feet seat sec the, the earthquake will last like 13 seconds 13 to 20 seconds 13 to 20 seconds the earthquake will last like 13 to 20 seconds but the first four seconds the first five seconds will be strong that's the one that will really cause commotions and this earthquake will cause some buildings to collapse it will cause many tears and many cracks and it will cause some people to die this is a warning from God this is a warning from God to the nation of Cameroon. I'm going to post this video on YouTube. And if you jump on this video, pray for the nation of Cameroon. Pray for the nation of Cameroon. This prophecy can be averted. You know why? If all the leaders, all the chiefs, all the leaders in Boya, and everybody organize an, a massive the regional repentance day, and cry to God for mercy, God will hear them and God will stop the earthquake. Because that earthquake is not like a must thing. But because of the too much sin in that area, in that land, in that area, God says he will release his judgment. He will release his judgment on that nation in, in Southwest region. I also see the judgment of God hitting the people in the northern part of Cameroon. I saw a lot of terrorism attack taking place there but God says the season of their unveiling has come so many of the people who have been doing the terrorist attack especially killing Christians especially robbing banks and robbing areas in the northern part of Cameroon have not been to Cameroon for six years now I don't even know what's happening in Cameroon right now in the northern region I God is my witness I don't even know what's happening there right now but I'm prophesying by the spirit by the spirit and so the northern region of Cameroon the terrorist attack there a lot of people will be caught a lot of people but but a lot of people who commit the negative atrocities 
All those people who will commit the negative atrocities, they will be caught. They will be caught. They will catch them. They will catch them. And they will be arrested and they will receive the judgment. So if you are listening to this video from Cameroon and you have been committing terrorism in the northern region, just repent and turn to God. Repent and turn to God. But again, the revival in Cameroon is going to be so massive, like I've said already. It's going to be so massive. And that revival is going to be... It's going to hit many nations. It's going to hit many nations. I saw God reviving. I saw God. I saw God anointing young apostles, young, young prophets, young pastors, young teachers, young evangelists. And God was spreading their wings. I saw their wings spreading like wings of angels. So a lot of things like that will happen. And God was using them mightily in many areas. So that revival will come. But I said revival will not just come in the area of the the. the uh, the church but it will also take place in the academics i saw and uh, it will take place in uh, many areas in cameroon i saw also socio economic the socio economic of uh, status of cameroon increasing so high i saw different things happening there but the season of the judgment of the earthquake that i'm talking about is gonna come soon you say when which month which year i don't know all is that i saw it and it's coming soon so prepare yourselves for the judgment now these are the words that I wanted to speak and I'm gonna be done right now a lot of people say um, you are in Ohio speak about Ohio God has not told me to speak about Ohio yet I'm seeing things about Ohio but I cannot speak yet because my time has not yet come to speak for Ohio so it's not everything that we see that we say so this is why I'm gonna end this prophetic message and so if you have heard all these prophetic messages there are more there are more prophetic messages that I've released, but I can't be repeating myself.